A tropical vacation becomes a nightmare when a ruthless killer strikes. He was shaking, and he was, his eyes were going around. Denis Papineau is on vacation in the Caribbean with his best friend, Ralph. The two buddies are on a day trip to the countryside when Denis notices that his friend is starting to behave strangely. He was sitting in the passenger seat in front, and he was kind of staring right in front of him. He was like dazed. Their destination is a freshwater lake in a secluded cave. The last thing I remember is getting out of the water, and suddenly it all turns into darkness. All his arms are shaking, and his, his eyes were, are wide open, and he's shaking a lot. As the minutes go, go by, I take his hand and ask him, if you can hear me, squeeze my hand. I didn't want him to pass out, so I kept talking to him right into his ear until the ambulance came. I wake up, I'm surrounded by nurses and doctors holding me down. I didn't know where I was. At that point, he's saying to me, what happened, what happened, where am I, where am I? The doctor told me there's something not right in the back of my head. They found out there's a cyst in the back of my brain. Based on his travel history, the location of the lesion, and the fact that it presented with seizures, I tell Ralph that this could very well be a pork tapeworm lava that is in his brain. A blood test confirms that Ralph is harboring a pork tapeworm in his brain. I mean, I have a seizure. Now I have a worm in my brain. I mean, after all, it's my brain. The pork tapeworm has two primary hosts, humans and pigs. The parasite larvae form cysts in the muscle tissue of a pig. If a human eats undercooked pork that contains the cysts, they get infected. In the human gut, the cysts hatch into adult tapeworms. Monsters inside me. Only on Animal Planet.